What do you think is the reason behind us not seeing enough uh, leaders in companies or government? Why aren't we seeing the kind of leaders we should have? There is a historic uh, element to this. We need to understand that uh, we have been under occupation for centuries. Mm. In an occupied nation, there is a certain psychology, that is, when you step out, don't don't raise your head and be seen, put your head down and just come home. Yeah. So always, wherever there is a problem, put your head mm. down and come away. Got it. This Got has it. been our attitude for centuries. Mm. It is only now that people are looking at being leaders, mm. otherwise leadership is always… was always in somebody else's hands. Got it. We just… our business was not to get into trouble. So it's significant now that uh, even if you look at yeah. it in many different ways, many of the corporate… corporate leaders today mm. uh, are people who are born in free India. Well, our prime minister himself, for the first time we have a prime minister born in free India. Right. Which is significant. Mm. This is a new generation mm. of people mm. who are thinking about where the nation should go and a certain pride about who we are. Right. Which… not that previous generation did not have it, but there was a, a very natural instinct mm. of when there is trouble, look away and go home. Right. Don't get True. into the situation. Yeah. <laughs> so there's a lot of social conditioning or mindset yes, uh, uh, changes. Centuries of uh, subjugation. I think uh, this generation should work to come out of that. Right. And uh, India is a, a tremendous pool of talent. Mm. But we have not done, done well in the country. Wherever else they go, Indians mm. do phenomenally yes. well. They don't do well here because lack of leadership and organization. So one of the biggest problems in India has been lack of leadership. When we utter the word leadership, people always think of prime minister, chief minister like mm, this. Mm. It is not just leadership on the top, we need leadership at every layer of society, right. which is completely missing. Today if a good leader arises, rest of the people will start worshipping him. Mm. A leader does not need worship, mm. what he needs is a reinforcement of various levels of leadership which will allow him to, you know, when he wants to do something, it'll find its way to the grassroots.